Okay, Intr introducing queens, M making splits. One, two, three, go. Uh, this video is hopefully will help other beekeepers, uh, uh, beekeepers that haven't introduced, ha haven't made splits. Uh, in other words, divide their hives, uh, uh, make, making splits. So you take some bees out of the hive and uh, you and you put them in a new hive and you leave the old queen in the original hive and so this is what I'm doing today and I'm going to put a, a new queen in the new hive I'm starting the queens will come in a little package like this and uh, some some worker bees when they package these bees up uh, worker bees uh, are are put in here to take care of the queen now what I am doing right now is I'm letting all the worker bees out of this little this little cage uh, maybe I hope you can see it in the camera there's there underneath here there's there's a sugar candy and on this end is a hole with a cork in it on this end, on both ends, is a hole with cork in it. Now when I take this cork out, the bees can get out. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take this cork out where the bees have direct access to the hole, like so. I'm going to lay the cork down. Now, I have already, I have already let about five or six workers out. Now I'm trying, there's, there's two workers in there left with the queen. What I'm achieving to do is let the, encourage the two worker bees to exit, leaving only the queen in this queen cage. Then I will put the cork back in here. The thinking is, if, there's, if there are no workers in this cage to take care of her, then the new bees in the hive will be more prone to feed her and take care of her through this screen. They can feed her through this screen. So, uh, like I say, uh, I'm trying to, to get the, the... Now, you can blow on it uh, to try to get the workers uh, to come out. Uh, beekeepers that never, never have done this you have to be focused. You have to keep your eye on the queen. Do not watch the hole. Do not watch the other bees. Do not watch the other bees coming out of the hole. You must keep your eye on the queen only. It, when you get down, right now I'm, I'm down to two, bee, two worker bees being in the cage with the queen. And usually it's difficult to get the last one and two worker bees out of there. Uh, all right, there just one come out. I hope you saw that. Okay, now I've got one worker bee left in here to, to get out. Um, if if that worker bee sticks her head in that hole, I can blow her out with my breath. But my, do you have to be careful because you will also blow out the queen. I have done that. Last year I did it. I lost the queen. And to make a long story short, the queen landed back in the palm of my hand. One chance in a million. Now, I'm trying to get that other, that last worker bee out of there. Okay, I blew that last worker bee out of there. Now, I'm going to put the cork back in that hole and stop it up. Now only this, this new queen, is she's a beautiful queen. Now the new queen is left in, inside the cage, okay? Now these worker bees that I let out, they're flying around here. Now, I'm going to... With a small nail, I'm going to take the cork out of the sugar end of the, the cage. 
Okay. Now, this end is cork. This hole is corked up, and she's in this cage. This is sugar candy. Okay. I took the cork out of this end. Now, the only thing between the queen and and the outside is this sugar candy. The bees in the hive will go in this hole and they will start eating that sugar candy. When they get when they've eaten a tunnel through to the queen, she can get out and by then we are hoping that that uh, the bees will uh, recognize her her scent as being her, their queen because if you just take a queen and put it directly into a hive they will kill her because that she has a different scent now so now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go into a hive and I'm gonna put this queen in her cage in the hive now I'm going to place it uh, in this case it really doesn't matter uh, some people find it difficult to let the workers out of the cage if you do not let the workers out of the cage then you must put the sugar candy in upward so if one of those bees die and you had the sugar candy hole on the bottom and one of those bees die then that dead bee may fall down and block the hole and not permit the queen to get out okay so since only the queen is in there it doesn't matter if I place this the sugar candy up or I place it down that doesn't matter now I'm gonna stop the camera and I'm gonna I'm gonna uh, uh, go show you as I put it into the hive okay